Hi, welcome back to the Alpha People channel. My name is Dan Goddard. The next short clip is presented again by Diaz, uh, one of our Dynamics developers. Uh, he's got something interesting for us today. Um, he will be exploring how to um, add a new navigation link in uh, CRM 2011. So on the left-hand navigation pane that you see there, uh, there will be a direct link that he will establish uh, between this account record and uh, an external website. So. Over to you, Diaz. Thanks, Dan. So let's add a navigation link on the account form. So the first question is in CRM 2011, where I could find the option to add a navigation link. Well, the simple answer is it's in the insert tab. If you go to insert tab, you could see a button called navigation link. So this is the key. Now, uh, it is disabled at the moment. So in order to enable, we need to choose the navigation element. Currently, the selection is on the body element. So if we click on navigation, you could see that the entire left menu area is en enabled. And then if we go to insert the uh, insert tab, you could see that the navigation link is enabled. This is the key. So let's click on the navigation link. So it will open up a new web page dialog. And now uh, we need to name our uh, our left uh, navigation link so let's call as alpha people now I need to choose an icon so I have already uploaded one uh, PNG file so I'm choosing that and then we have uh, two options either we could choose a web resource or an external URL I'm, I'm going to demonstrate both so first uh, let's let's uh, do with the let's opt uh, external URL so I have one external URL here which is our company uh, news page so um, I'm going to provide that link here and uh, just click OK so you could see a left navigation link called alpha people here and now uh, we need to go to the home pay home tab and then we need to uh, save the page and then after saving we need to obviously we need to publish it so once this uh, customization is published then we could see the left navigation on the account form now I'm going to open an existing account and check whether whether we have the left navigation link is there or not so you could see an alpha people link here and I'm clicking on it so we could we could see the news page uh, which we provided as the URL over there. So this is the first part that we we tried with the uh, left navigation. The second part of this demonstration is to provide a web resource as a uh, left navigation link. So in order to do that, we need to uh, double click on the alpha people link here, and we need to choose a web resource. So I'm going to choose a uh, web resource which which I have al already uploaded. Uh, it is a simple uh, HTML page. Uh, I could show you the simple HTML page. So it just contains one uh, body and uh, you know header. It's very simple one. So now um, I have chosen the web resource as HTML. So uh, then I need to uh, click OK. So I should be able to see this uh, sample HTML page. So obviously we need to save that and then uh, publish in order to see the changes. So let's open an existing account and uh, see whether the change is in place or not. So uh, I'm going to click on the alpha people link here. So I should be able to see the HTML page which we already provided. So here is it. So uh, this is a key feature in CRM 2011 because we could provide any any kind of uh, HTML page or civil light page, any web resources as a left navigation link which, which is a very good feature. So thanks for listening to me and have a nice day. Okay, thanks Diaz, very useful. Um, from now, uh, we'll be looking at filtering records, dashboard visualization, SharePoint, drag and drop in the form editor. Again, we'll be uh, delving deeper into CRM charts in the future. In the meantime, if you need to contact us, the uh, uh, address is on screen with the phone number and the website, all the w's.alphapeople.com. Uh, in the meantime, thanks for watching and goodbye for now.